Hey Twitters, a quick one on natural gas, gold and crude oil. So I'm going to start my analysis with natural gas today. So before I start my analysis, let me show you what I've said in my previous video. If you want to look at the Fibonacci tool from here, just mark your buffer zone. You already got the retest of 50% retracement and the target can be 6.804 and goes up to 6.867. We already got a retest so we can expect market to push up from here, from this zone. Exactly. So we took this trade right here. We got a nice retest on our Fibonacci tool. After retest, our target has been hit right here, exactly right here. And that was a successful trade. So what to expect next from natural gas? I'm going to talk on Oanda first and then I'm going to come back on currency.com. So right here on Oanda, after our take profit hit, you can see market has hit 161 retracement and now we are getting an engulfing candle and also looking at the factor the market is out to overbought but as you can see the natural gas is in a very strong bullish momentum and the russian ukraine tensions are still growing every single day and which is causing natural gas to go much higher and expensive as mentioned yesterday russia is also demanding to trade natural gas in rubles which is also a reason natural gas is getting expensive I've done a bit of research on that. So now what to expect next? Here you can see we have market break above the level of resistance, which will now act as a level of support. Looking at an engulfing candle, if this candle closes here in next 35 minutes, then this is a good entry to take long trade. And also if you look at our Fibonacci retracement from here, we got a retest of 50% retracement and we have a nice buffer zone, same as yesterday, right here. So this is our buffer zone, which is 6.671. It goes down to 6.514. So we already got a retest and looking at the bullish pressure, we can still expect gas to hit at least 7.127. It can go up to 7.241, which is our 161 retracement. So we can, ex we can expect a dip back from to this zone as well because of the overbought situation but looking at the conditions the natural gas is still bullish and expect some long trades only so let's check on currency.com same here we are in our resistance zone and we are getting an engulfing candle market hit over 161 retracement and looking at the fibonacci tool we already got a retest with this candle with this engulfing candle if this candle closes here then we have a likely chances market can hit 7.215 goes up to 7.355 we can expect a push down as well between our buffer zone which is 6.700 goes down to 6.557 we can expect a pullback the market is now overbought as well and we can expect expect a bounce and we can see a push up can still go up without retesting we are also getting this inverted hammer candle right here which shows a bearish pressure and looking at the rsi overbought situation if we get this candle close like this below this red candle then there's a likely chance we can get a push down to 20 ma to get a bounce up again let's check gold gold is now above a level of major structure resistance which will now act as a level of support we are expecting a push down after this nice engulfing candle but this zone has not been respected and gold is also now in a nice uptrend and looking at Fibonacci targets we already got a retest right here and the market moved up already from this zone we can expect gold to hit 1987 and it can go up to 1999 or you can take a 1 ATR targets from the 50% retracement whatever the 1 ATR is telling us you can take your target accordingly looks like the target has been hit already but you can still expect gold to move up let's check crude oil so crude oil as expected the market pushed up from our major level of support as we talked about yesterday as expected market pushed up dramatically from here and we didn't get any sort of entry confirmation but the market did ex did respect this level of major support and if you look at the daily time frame we are now getting a nice engulfing candle on daily time frame right here so in the long term i'm expecting a market to hit at least 107.5 six seven so oil is still bullish at the moment as it's above support so any questions buzz me on instagram i'll get back to you asap i hope you trade green till then take care